Welcome to Stewie's Garage. Today we're learning how to test for vacuum leaks using a homemade smoke tester. Alright, so what we got going on here is my homemade smoke tester. It's an old soldering iron um, that's just mounted to the top of this mason jar. And it's sitting on a towel a shop rag that has mineral oil on it. So that's going to start generating smoke here in just a second. Um, I've made two fittings. So we've got inflow of air, which I just use this little bike pump um, to pump it up and it'll push the smoke into the system and then we have the vacuum line that actually enters the engine and so I just broke into the system through this little port right here and then plugged my vacuum line with this little cap. Um, so I'm just doing a smoke test. We're trying to find any leaks in the engine. Um, we're testing all these vacuum lines throughout the engine. There's a ton of them over here by the turbo. Um, and then I couldn't find anything small enough to plug this giant hole, so I used this can of degreaser. Um, but I plugged off the intake, or the, yeah, the intake from the air cleaner, so that the only way for the smoke to leave is through the exhaust. So we really want to, like, pressurize this system to see if there's any leaks on the vacuum side. So you can kind of see it's it's building up smoke inside the jar. Um, it's going to keep getting more and more full as time goes on. Um, you'll see it in a minute here. Okay, now you can see that that smoke tester is nice and full of smoke. And we're going to pump the smoke into the system. You can see it's swirling like that. We know the system's going to start filling up with smoke. Um, so that's kind of what we're doing. We'll see if there's any leaks. So if you look, I don't know if you'll be able to see that. The camera, you see there's a little smoke leak right here. A little vacuum leak. That's where we're seeing smoke. So. Come on. Camera, just stay. We'll pump it. And there's the smoke coming out. So yeah, we do have a vacuum leak right here. 